as we desperately wanted to bounce back with a win after last weekend's result, 2-1 away to Highworth. What are your thoughts on the game? Oh yeah, yeah. Like it, we're, um, we now need to kick on and be consistent with, with results. Um, as you say, we needed to re respond to last week's disappointing result against Biddeford. Again, we sit, we've always said there's no such thing as easy games in this division and we know Highworth had a good start to the season. They're out there right in around the playoff situation a bit like ourselves, but we always know that this is a hard place to come to. Like well managed side and uh, like with good players. So I felt from the first whistle today we were at it. I think we showed that first half. It was nil nil, but I felt we went in at half time fully confident that we could like, really kick on in the second half. And we did. I think we deservedly 2 0 to the good. Obviously, last 10 minutes, like, when we conceded a goal with not many minutes to go, it sort of makes it look a little bit desperate and you get anxious. And like obviously, when confidence levels still need a little bit more restoring, it makes it a bit, um, you know, you, you feel that you're clinging on. But I think we're well worthy of a win today. And now we now we look forward to next week. We've got a, a massive club coming to us in Froome Town, a side probably that should be in this division. So we know we got to, we got to be bang at it. But I, I trust and believe in the players to, to be that way. And maybe in a week's time, we might even have a stronger position with the squad. So uh, that, that's that's what we're all looking forward to now. And what pleased you most with the, today's win? Because 1 to 11, every player was fantastic out there today. We felt like for, throughout the game, we felt that, like every player to a man was was bang at it. Um, I think training in a week has sort of re regrouped everybody um, and it needed to happen. I felt the game was allowed to be played in a correct vein as well. I thought the referee and his two assistants were absolutely outstanding today as well because they're not only the way they allowed the game to be played and, and maybe tackles to be made because sometimes in, in the modern world of football you're not allowed to make tackles that today they were honest tackles it wasn't nothing that was uh, unfair but the referee encouraged that he allowed it and he was a class act in the way he positioned himself and what I will say is like beyond anything today the communication from him and his two assistants like when their advantages were played and maybe it was questioned at times he, he, a quick word from the man and it, he, like he just showed great respect to everybody and like, we showed it back with interest so like, I feel everyone played their part today like I believe my team were bang at it high were for a good side and they're going to be in and around it like hopefully the same areas the tables were aiming to be as well do you know what I mean we, we, we take nothing for granted but we have got high opinion on this season in terms of what we want to achieve and I thought the referee and his two assistants were outstanding as well Absolutely and really nice to get Mikey Bryant's goal first of the season with a, with a direct header in the, first, in the second half just a word on Mike. Mike. Mike Bryant's a manager's dream, to be honest. Like he's a, he's a, he's a man that you know he's clever. He gives pockets of information. He's not a sh like a shout and a baller, but he gives it in in the right vein and and it gets taken in the right vein because he's a, a like a, a respected football player. Like obviously the season at the start has been a bit of a slow burner for Mike purely and simply because he, he he got struck down with the COVID and it sort of had a, had a, an impact on him, which obviously it is it is had on many a person. So it took him a little bit while to get back up to his his levels, but in recent weeks we're seeing his importance to the team. The Portland game away from home was probably his first time that I felt we're now seeing Mike Bryant of what we'd expect. Um, last week was just a, 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 an under par performance by everybody, so it was hard to pick out positives from that one. And today, like again, he's been a massive part of us being bang at it from the start, and, and Mike Bryant's an important man for me. 